assets of Switzerland prior to uh, five or six years ago thought the IRS would never find them either. And they did. You know, one uh, whistleblower took a, a CD with all the names and handed it to the IRS, and some of those people are in jail. Uh, you know, they, they, they've uh, arrested brothel owners uh, for tax evasion by counting the laundry bill. They said, you know, they, words, they, they, they put the burden of proof on you. They say, no, we estimate your taxes the following. Prove it's not. Burden of proof is on you. So um, they're going to come into all these exchanges. They're going to re request all the books and records. Uh, the exchange is going to give them up, or they'll be shut down, they'll be frozen. Uh, remember, even if you're a Bitcoin exchange, you still have to, uh, your points of connection with the dollar payment system, or the euro payment system, you got to get the money in to sell the people the Bitcoin. They're, they're, they can all be shut down, they can all be interdicted, uh, the thing, all these things can be frozen, the IRS has all the authority they need. So between the SEC looking at initial coin offerings, the IRS looking at tax evasion, the FBI looking at criminality, uh, and who knows what else is going on. I just don't want to play in that space.